Alrighty, we still got one more crew member to find out where in the world they are. And it's just, it's just so appropriate that Zoro is last. Episode 421 and 422 of our One Piece watch through. We found out where everybody's been sent to and for what reason they've been sent to each place. Who knows? And the last two, we found out that Robin was sent to this very dark slave labor camp on a bridge. And then on the flip side of things, Usopp is on a, a plant, man-eating plant island with a guy named like Hercules, basically. I I, I have no idea, but I'm so intrigued as to where Zoro is because I feel like it has to be some kind of joke because he's always lost. If you're new to the channel, drop a sub and hit that big boy bell and let's hop into it. I love how every one of these episodes starts with just Boa like swooning over uh, over uh, Luffy and Luffy just eat. She made a little cut. That is so cute. Oh my gosh. Dude, she's like... It's like middle school, high school love. I told you, forget. Is he wearing Roger's jacket? <laughs> That's what that looks like. It's like the gold with the red. He's like king of the pirates with his women. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh. oh, God. Yeah, you gotta fight for that love, Boa. Fight for it. She's already pointing down on, on Nami and Robin. She has not even met them. Oh my gosh, she's way too... Dude, the bodies are stacked up. <laughs> Bro's face is kind of creeping me out, man. Something isn't right. Oh no, they're on to her. Grand line, correct. Oh, this is Zoro. Who's the Shikoro King? Wait, what? Is this Perona? Oh my gosh. Why are we checking in on Perona? Wait, this is where this is where she said she wanted to go. A place like this. How are we checking on God dang Perona and not Zoro? There's no way Zoro got sent to the same place as her. This is amazing. This is absolutely amazing. She's such a baby without her, all, without all of her servants. This place is kind of cool though. The castle is so beautiful, like in contrast to the rest of the land. That looks like a Nightmare Before Christmas type type hill. No way is that Zoro. No way do Zoro and Perona end up in the same place. She's just flying over. They will not get along. She will annoy the life out of him. But why would he send Zoro to the same place as her? None of it makes sense. Oh my gosh, it is him. Oh my gosh. Ain't no way. She knows who it is too. Uh-huh. I wonder if he sends Zoro there like, yeah, finish the job. <laughs> this is the most random pairing I've ever seen in my life. These two characters alone. Serves you right. For what? You got smacked here too. Dog, what is happening? The vibes of this place are its so creepy, but oh, is she treating Zoro? She is. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait. I th it seemed like she like couldn't have cared less about him. Wow. Shout out Perona. What the? What, wait, what, what changed? She literally just said serves you right. I need to go back to the beginning of the episode. It didn't say the location of this island, did it? Or did it say? I think it said Grand Line. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like the inside of Thrower Bark, too. Actually, she probably has somewhat control over Zoro with Negative Hollow. He looked like a zombie. Why'd you say Sword Singular? <laughs> I don't think you're in condition, Zoro. She's been recovering here for a bit. Yeah, no, she's, she's got a grip on him. And she's got his blades. She calls the shots around here. It's not cute. She saved him just for him to serve her. Oh my. <gasps> she made him into a replacement, Kumasi? No shot. Oh my gosh. You were so mean to Kumasi. She got the eyes right and everything. Oh my gosh, this is just like as low as Zoro has ever been. This is disastrous. This is his hell. This is actually his hell. I don't know who hates their life more right now, Zoro or Sanji. Yeah? <laughs> you couldn't tell him the exit even if you wanted to. He took it off. <laughs> I'm surprised she's just letting him leave. She's like, nah, you're gonna find three more. 
<laughs> She's lonely, man. She just wanted a friend. She just doesn't know how to say it. I would have never guessed in a million years that this is where Zoro ended up, and this is who Zoro ended up with. <laughs> Giant Perona! <laughs> I figured she wouldn't let him leave. Especially if she can control him like this. And he still doesn't have his blades. Alright, well, I don't know if this is gonna be the last we see of Zoro. I, I feel like some islands are gonna have like a lot more to Oh my gosh, Brooke! How did I forget about Brooke? Where is Brooke? Oh my gosh! Namakura Island. Wait, wasn't this where, isn't this where Zoro is? Yeah, isn't this, oh, the land of poverty, Harahetanya. Oh, maybe same island, different place? How did I forget about Brooke, bro? It's cause he's the newest. Oh, this looks kind of spooky actually. Is that an Afro lamb? Kind of looks like Mary's face too. What is going on here? Satan? What? What is happening here? This is not real. This is just not real. Oh my God, and Brooke's gonna land. Oh my gosh. And they're gonna think Brooke is Satan because he's just a, a, a skull, a, a bones. He's just bones. He's just a skeleton. That looks like Mary, bro. Mary with an Afro and horns. Oh my gosh, there is no way. He's gonna land right in the middle, isn't he? Oh my gosh. It's, it's him. It's the devil. <laughs> Of course, he's the one to land here, man. Is the Afro okay? That's the question. The long arm tribe took everything from us? Dude, he landed perfectly in the center, too. Dude, everybody's landing spot could not have possibly been more varying. Oh, he's cracked. He just joined the crew, too, man. Oh, he's got a cult already. He's gonna, like, recruit them to help him get back. They literally have followers already. This girl is like terrified. Sacrifice her! There's no way they offer someone up. Please don't ask to see her panties, Brooke. Please, man. Please don't. No, don't. Don't do it. Please don't do it. Don't say it. I know you're gonna say it. Just don't say it. He's so disappointing. <laughs> Everyone was like, here, Satan, here! Returning to the present to rescue his brother. <laughs> What's going on, man? Oh, I want to see Impel down so bad. There's just too much to check on, man. There's too much happening. Oh, no. Lieutenant Stalker. There is no way that's this guy's name. I don't think the Empress would say that. What an investigation. I'll give myself a mohawk. <laughs> they all just got mohawks instantly. Five times? God, Luffy. Try and play it a little low-key, man. You pass up meals for, her, for me. She can get away with anything. Six days left. God damn. That paper is so burned, man. Tensions at the HQ. Let's go back to the HQ. Oh, shoot. Oh my God, it's T-Bone. Oh, T-Bone. No way, is that Jonathan from G8? What is happening, bro? Jonathan. Oh my God, is that a giant? Ugh. There's Aokiji. Dude, Kizaru! She's one of the Elder Star. No, I don't think she's an Elder Star. Meanwhile, Marie Joy. Oh my god, they're all gathered. Oh my. Dude! <laughs> Gekko Moria sitting with all of them is the funniest thing and for no reason. Is Kuma not in trouble for what happened? Like, uh, hello? Oh, is this back to Ace? Oh, shoot. What's he got? It wasn't the first thing he asked him was how are you or are you still alive? God, they must have like tortured him to like no end. Because of him in particular? I don't they just wanted to use him as how are you laughing right now, Garp? That's your grandson, bro. Uh, I disagree. Someone named someone named Luffy can. Oh no, the war. Yeah, no, the war seems pretty inevitable. They've they've like uh, ruined this man. 
Gojo. <laughs> King of the sea. Damn. I don't know how Garb gets away with everything he does. Like, like not listening to Sengoku, going to see Ace, like... Father? Why did he say like he wants to see Dragon? Like, Garb must have done a lot for the Navy in his time to be able to get away with this kind of stuff. I mean, he let Luffy go originally, and Sengoku was like, what are you doing, you goofball? Whenever Luffy was like a pretty high profile already pirate at the time. I want to know more about Garb, to be honest, but seeing Ace like this is just so sad. It's just bizarre, like, seeing how Garb treats the situation when, like I said, it's his grandson. I don't know, man. May uh, maybe him saying father is a sign that Dragon's going to step into the picture because we really haven't seen anything from him. Episode 422, let's go! Oh yeah, no, the complete opposite happened. You just a government dog, Garp? Dude, Ace is probably so proud. Some tough love. I wonder if this is the first he's hearing about what Luffy did. I'm so proud? Doesn't seem like it! He smiles. Well, yeah, surprised that he knew, like ran into him and didn't even know. <laughs> they were destined to, for them to become pirates. That's what I was wondering. Why his yeah, his last name isn't Monkey. Okay. Oh, he hates Dragon. Oh. Oh, because his mother raised him. Oh. So it wasn't it wasn't that that dragon did anything. It's that the fact that he did nothing. And this is where Whitebeard took him in. Dang, dude. He just took his mother's name. I'm so glad I cleared that up. I'm still kind of like really confused. He sees Whitebeard as his father. Uh, I, it makes sense if Dragon was never around. But it seems like Dragon's just like really fixated on this whole like revolutionary army. But where does the like part of the revolutionary army play? Like, what part does that play into this entire thing with the emperors and, and the government? With Whitebeard and the government? I'm guessing they would hate the government because it's a revolutionary army, but... Oh, Momonga. Buggy! No way! <laughs> no way! It's been so long since I've seen Buggy. I miss him. Please let let's see him. <laughs> These goobers, man. It's been so long. Albina! Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Albina? Fortune on internal. Wait, why did they come here? Buggy's in jail! No, my boy! His crew's trying to save him? Aww. That's a good crew. Yeah. It's almost like you've got to sneak aboard a Navy ship. Buggy will be executed. His friend Ace. <laughs> Oh gosh. <laughs> Richie crying thinking about food. Possible to break in or out. Dude, how's this gonna go down then? Nah, it, it really hasn't because there's a rubber man going in. I don't know how Buggy would feel about seeing Luffy though. Captain John's treasure island. What's Buggy's bounty? Oh. <laughs> He's still thinking about food, isn't he? Different food. Richie! This is so amazing, man. She's taking Buggy's ship? Oh. She's yoinking it! Yeah, she's smart. She's like, I ain't going to impel down, bro. Dude, how do you even get in, man? Is there a front desk? Is there an elevator? Their, their idea is they're going to march in and just get captured right away. Oh, or get eaten. <laughs> they dipped on my boy. No shot. That's all it took? Have a peaceful execution. Damn, they really not ride or dies, huh? What a sequence of events to let us know that Buggy is also an impel down. Oh, shoot. They almost there. Oh, shoot. They're going to pass by Innie's lobby, which is just flattened, I guess. Great underwater prison. We finally get to see it, man. It's like Alcatraz times 10. Oh my gosh. Dude, no wonder anyone can, can't break out. I'm guessing there's just like sea prism stone, like handcuffs and like cuffs on everybody too. 
God damn. Just torture everybody. Yo, Luffy, uh, listen, man. Uh, our cell leader? Oh, who's the leader? Tell me it's Buggy. No, Buggy. Buggy's probably struggling in here, man. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, is he the cell leader on the pillow? Oh my gosh. There's like a whole hierarchy. What is that? Is that a guard? Like an ox? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It does look like it's just like a giant ox. Damn. Oh my goodness. I figured this would be an intense prison, but is this solitude? No, solitude. Solitary is where you're alone. Oh my gosh. What is it? Who are they sharing a cell with? Do they just throw people in there to die? What is this? What is this prison? This is just hell on earth. It's a lion. Multiple lions. Four and a half days. That's how long this city would take to get there. Dude. It's like belly of the beast, man. This is crazy. This is this is so insane. This is madness. It's just like seeing so many things like connecting and whatnot, like just seeing Buggy's crew and freaking out that Buggy's an impel down. It's just like another little thing that was like forever ago, but it's like another little piece of this world. Dude. And they going straight into it. Mmm. Oh. Okay. What was Boa's reason for wanting to make a pit stop? Dar she blows. Oh, so there's like above water sections too. That's the halfway point? <laughs> I thought the episode was over. It's probably just because like so many POVs have happened and so many so much is like going on at the same time that's hard to keep up. But now we know where everybody is to an extent. I mean general location yeah i was gonna say delayed because they said four days not four and a half okay so now is she just gonna like put luffy back in her dress again and they're gonna walk in like they have to have some better plan right yeah ace's cell also looks way lower than everybody else i mean i'm guessing because he's scheduled for execution so he's in solitary because where garb went like there was no one else down there and it looks really far down it seems there's like a general population area like a regular prison and then an area where they keep like the bigger criminals Dude, shout out Boa though, my goodness. This is not a possible mission without her. <laughs> it's many men swooning at the same time. No, Boa, come on, don't. <laughs> at least he's honest. You have to give him some props for that. Stop talking, Luffy. I guess the only benefit here is like Luffy's gonna go in without C prism like cuffs. Oh, she asked to see Ace. What, does she have reasoning? Oh, shoot. A strict body search. Oh, no. There's no way they get they get away with this. Dude, at this point... Buggy has vanished from his cell? What do you mean? Vice Warden. Oh, who's the Warden? Dude, this is getting intense, man. The fact that Buggy has escaped from his cell at the same time that Luffy is sneaking in here too. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Let's go time. No more messing around. Bo is part of this now too. It's inevitable that they find out that Luffy's here. The entire goal is a breakout, a jailbreak, but they're gonna have to be real quiet about it if they wanna get out safely. I don't know, man. I feel like there's gonna be like an insane number of levels of security. God, dude, it's like a gulag. My impa oh, is this the warden? Oh, I said my jumping the gun. Hannibal, like Hannibal? Hannibal. Okay, so he, I, I guess he's wanting to become warden because he said I jumped the gun. Magellan. Okay, on level four. I would also like to meet the warden. Hey, yo, Domino, what's up, girl? <laughs> oh no, here we go. Okay, wh what's the plan here, Luffy? Wh like, genuinely. Warm water of hell. Oh, lovely. Oh my God. This is just, just like actually hell. <gasps> Newcomers. Yes, dude. Crocodile is here. They did say the warlord isn't. <laughs> There's so many people here, man. Way more than I first attested. I mean, I figured there'd be a lot of people to impel down, but the crocodile is here, man. Oh God. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. They're gonna have to take her down. Like, the operation begins now. Oh, they have cameras, too? Oh, God. No. 
Oh, this is such a disaster, man. Snails! Oh, God. These guys are shameless. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, did she talk no jutsu her way out of this? Or she's waiting for Luffy to make a move? Did the cameras, like, you, it, it's just, it, you, it, it's gonna happen one way or another. It's go time. Dude, the fact that Luffy is this close to Ace, too. It, uh, you're just gonna have to go loud. I'm sorry. The C Prism Stone's, cha like, cuffs change a lot, too. Like, disabling Devil Fruit powers changes so much. The heartbeat. Oh, my gosh! I was gonna say how many days. I'm sorry. Didn't it say there were like four days left? Or is that? Oh, no, I guess four and a half days. Pet. No, it was because when we were flashing where everybody was on, on the islands, that was sort of like a flashback because it was at the same time that Luffy was landing on Amazon Lily. So at the point that this is taking place, I guess more time has passed on those islands with all the straw hats than we've seen. So more has gone on. We just saw their initial interactions with everything. The one I want to revisit most, by the way, is Robin by far. But this, this entire like concept surrounding and pal down is so cool not knowing who we're gonna run to run into buggy's on the loose somewhere for some reason how did he get out i mean i would i would like chalk anything up to devil for powers if these these sea prism the sea prism concept didn't exist but crocodile is here brother i mean at this point like i said it's gonna have to be like you're just going loud there's no like clean way to do this maybe if there weren't cameras there would be some way to either convince this this uh i think they called her like the prisoner captain or something like maybe freeze her unfreeze her and see if she forgot her memory there might be some way out of it but i don't think there is with cameras either way it's super spicy insanely spicy here in impel down gonna be a crazy like i guess look into how that we're gonna how the hell we're gonna get ace out of here but either way i'm here for the ride if you're new to the channel drop us up and hit that big boy bell you're not gonna want to miss more episodes from what i can tell and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace